Hi again, this is the Cool Geek and in the previous video we have seen how we can get the number of days between two dates. In this video tutorial today, I'm going to show you the use of day, month and year function and then how we can recombine them using date function. So let us begin with day function. It's very simple. Just type in day and give a serial number as I've already mentioned in the first video what a serial number is. It's basically a representation of date within Excel. So a serial number, let's say the start date, 1st April 2016, close the bracket, it will give you the, it will give you one. So basically it just gives the day part of your date. The second function is month, M-O-N-T-H, month, and you give a serial number, it will extract the month part of it. So April is the fourth month, that is why we have four. Obviously it will not extract the string, it is a numerical output. So that's why we have four here now again you can say year and it will if, if you provide a serial number it will give you 2016 so that's how you uh, extract the day part month part and year part using day month and year function so in the next video i'll show you how to use the date function to combine day month and year to produce a serial number or a date do keep watching